first round of applause was not for the performers but for North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Do you guys hear that? The first round of applause is not for the performers, it's for him, Kim Jong-un. Hey what up guys, my name is Kinra and welcome back to my channel. So I know that a lot of pumpkins are K-pop lovers and when we talk about K-pop, we usually refer to South Korean pop. But like what about in North Korea? Do they have K-pop as well? Because it's like they're still Koreans, right? But I know that because of the tradition, uh, fashion style, skincare, like nutrition, everything, North Koreans kind of look different from South Koreans. So today, I'm gonna do a reaction video to North Korean pop. Only if there's one, if there's none, we're gonna end this video here, okay? Anyways, let's begin the video. North Korean idols. Do they have North Korean boy groups like, kind of like Alice first style? Okay, I don't mean to be rude. It's BTS from North Korea. Why people ask such a stupid question? North men escape from <laughs> men escaped from North Korea for Girls' Generation. How did this guy even know about Girls' Generation when they have kind of like blocked internet? Okay, it seems like we can't find anything here. Let's end the video. North Korea... Pop... <laughs> Rap favorite. <laughs> okay, here, we found something. North Korean... Morambon... Ban... I actually wonder one thing. Would they copyright me if I play the music here? Because... No, they're not supposed to use YouTube. When is this video from? Is it like 10 years ago? Okay, there's some basic information here. So it's like, they made their world to build. World to build? Wait, but like, for who? Okay, so eight years ago. Ah, uh, okay. Let's don't finish the music. So here's some of my thoughts about this group. So unlike the K-pop we usually know, um, they look kind of like, I would say they're not as young as those K-pop idols we know. Probably their age is around 30, I, I'm not sure, but it seems to me it's like this. And about the music style, um, it sounds like a national anthem. It's more like the song for your country in Soviet Union style or like communist style. Okay, just it may not be that fashionable compared to now. You know what I'm talking about, right? But let's watch this one. It's not the same song, right? Mm. Okay, basically it's the same thing. Um, I would say they actually look better than my expectation. But yeah, they look kind of different from South Koreans. What do you think about it? Tell me, okay? And... Wait here. EXO in North Korea? A few moments later... What is clickbait? Okay, I thought it's real. I think that the biggest North Korean pop star is Kim Jong Un, probably. The first round of applause was not for the performers, but for North Korean leader Kim Jong Un. Do you guys hear that? The first round of applause is not for the performers; it's for him, Kim Jong Un. In a surprise appearance to take in some South Korean K-pop, a brand of music ordinarily banned in the country and which South Korea has used for propaganda purposes in the past. <laughs> If the audience knew the songs, they might have thought it wise not to reveal it. Still, they seem to enjoy themselves. The audience gave us a great response. They clapped a lot and sang along. Literally, I'm wondering, when Red Velvet was performing in North Korea, how did they feel? Like, were they nervous? Because it's not like in South Korea, maybe you can offend someone because of something that you didn't expect. So I'm kind of scared of North Korea. Maybe it's my stereotype, but I don't know. I don't want to go there. At the concert, they gave us a big hand even after we left the stage. So I was really touched. Oh. The South Koreans even That's got to great. meet the man himself. Kim Jong-un posing for a group photo with the visitors. There were songs from Cho Yong-pil, who was making
making a return visit, having performed in Pyongyang 13 years ago. Um, let's read some comments, maybe. <laughs> Wait, this one. Everyone knows Kim Jong Un invented K-pop. <laughs> yeah. So some of you guys may not know about this. Kim Jong Un always claims that he invented a lot of things um, and also his father so i remember that they said they landed on the sun i mean north korea has landed on the sun successfully makes a lot of sense right and second is that they invented hamburgers that's kind of obvious as well right just somehow americans stole some hamburgers and said that they invented probably <laughs> year later north korea's new k-pop band kim vivid I want to see Kim singing and dancing with the K-pop stars. That's so bad. I'm fine with everything as long as there is no war. Yeah, that's true. Because South and North Korea, they always have conflicts. Okay, funniest video. North Korean reaction to K-pop. Uh, it's the same video that we watched. The audience is doing the mannequin challenge. When everyone is listening to my presentation. It doesn't have that concert vibe, you know. It's more like like this, like your parents sitting there watching your kids performing in front of them. Kind of like that. But wait, I was gonna make a video about North Korean pop idols. Why am I checking Red Velvet right now? It's not good. Okay guys, you know what? We are off topics anyway. So let's watch this one. 10 differences between North Korea and South Korea. I don't know why, because they use Jin. Okay, we have to check that out. South Korea often left in the dark, unaware of what's really good. If this is your for North Korea likes to tell its people that they're at the forefront of every industry, including the beauty market. But this couldn't be any further from the truth. Just so you know, North Korea always claims that they are the first in everything and they invented everything. South Korea has proven to be a leader in the industry. A few moments later. So this video is not about Jin at all, so, so I got clickbaited just like you guys did by my video. I'm sorry. Wait, come on, show me some idols, okay? Here. So in this video today, we are going to be comparing female South Korean pop idols with North Korean pop idols. The focus will be on... So I guess they have only female idols in North Korea. The way each nationality present themselves in the music videos and the locations in which they are set in. This will be a critical analysis, so I'll try and go into as much detail as I can. Mm -hmm. Their song is called Dalyo Kaja Mirero. In English, it's called Dash to the Future. Ironically, the song is about the future, but the style sounds like in the past. Already we can see the difference. One is created by a government, the other by a corporation. To start off with, let's watch 10 seconds of each music video. Other symbols include the faces of supreme leaders and the communist star. Very much related to red and its origins in North Korean communism. Communist the style. are about as western as this girl group will get so far. In the background, they are surrounded by other musicians, many of which are likely to be soldiers or high-ranking officials within the North Korean government. So after all, all these performances, they are not for normal people, like normal citizens like us. They are for like, successful people in the army or in the government. It's like luxury performance. Anyway, know them. Let's read comment directly. I feel bad for the North Korean band because they look like they have a forced smile. Yeah, I, I agree to this. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. They're still stuck on 1970s. Honestly, I don't know what am I doing. I wanted to check some North Korean K-pop idols, but seems like the internet is blocked or this thing doesn't exist. Like, okay, they have like one group and that's it. And why would I even think about this idea? But I should have expected that because in North Korea, they literally don't let anyone know their stuff, so... But, okay, let's take a last shot. Kim Jong-un personally created the Morambong band to modernize its pop scene. However, rather than looking sleek and polished like its southern counterpart, they look like something out of Eurovision 1979. Are you sure about that? So guys, I tried my best to search for more stuff, but there's barely anything that I can check. If you found something, just comment down below and tell me, okay? Kind of interested in them. I'm not gonna judge much about their pop culture because I, I, I don't want any problems, you know? So that's it for today's video. I hope you learned something from this video. For example, hamburgers were invented by Kim Jong-un, okay? And also they landed on the sun. No, no, I mean like they have, or they used to have a pop idol group. 
Anyways, that's not important. Main important thing is that follow my Instagram. I put it here, okay? That's the main important thing. And I think that's it. So I'll see you next time, okay? Bye.